Welcome back my friends, I'm Daily Fix, we're playing Star Trek New Horizons as the Federation of Planets. So uh, we started the Federal Quest actually to integrate these guys into the Federation of Planets. Uh, even though it sounds absolutely amazing, I, um, well, we'll have to see. We, we can actually review the status here. Um, fine, well, it's actually so expensive. So, let's do, let's do a high one, a high, uh, and see how far they, they have come. Uh, I still want to do something about my relationship with the Andorians, because it's an, at an all-time low. I bought a lot of minerals to do some work on my planets, as you can see over here, which will definitely do something for my consumer goods, but... Probably not in time. Let's buy a few. Construction complete. There you go. Um, food. Food and minerals here are the, um, the resource styles that I'm focusing on right now. I'm also probably going to start building defensive platforms uh, with all of my, uh, my stations because I haven't done so at all. Uh, also meaning we are going to take a look at uh, some of these... Uh, options this one i've no clue what this does no clue fleet order cancelled cannot reach its survey okay okay do oh, okay leader died that's a bit of a shame do we have leaders here which are anything well yeah let's let's start with you and go do some automatic exploration i guess uh, the Kardashians have been um, sending some insults every now and then. Which is annoying, but not something that will uh, probably change anytime soon. Uh, the Nausians are in this sort of sector. Hmm. An extra fleet would be very nice, and we definitely would need the 277 of energy. Uh, but I'm worried what will happen to the rest of our economy. We're just slowly waiting for everything to pop up and see what it will actually do. So we're negative 40, negative 14. We'll have to see at the end of the episode what changed and how can we use it to our advantage. Okay, interesting I guess. We're also sending out colony ships to some of the planets that we weren't able to colonize but we are now because some of the endurans are living in our space ah, i wish i could do something about this but them being rivaled to us is just so annoying also orions have been claiming some of our space can we actually see that let's take a quick look damn we've been claimed they have been claimed, actually. Wolf Tree 5... No, S Sirius been claimed? No, which Wolf Tree 5, 9, right? No, it's Sirius. Hmm. That would be bad. Look, um... We do not permit claiming in systems. I've been looking for that, and I was... I, well, it was a bit... Uh, I was hoping it wouldn't come to that. We can't, actually. And it's a bit of a shame. Okay, let's research you. Founding the Galactic Market. So, we should decide to complete... Uh, to compete for a title of market host. In the decision. So, I'd say let's go to Earth. Galactic Market does sound quite nice. Also, I would like to go in with the Armstrong City. This one cost us a tiny bit, but I think we want to do that. The competitive ratings is weak, so eventually we want to get some trade platforms in. Um, revoke nomination? No way, go away. Why would I do that? So, the Armstrong, special Armstrong city, let's do it as well. Yeah, it's been expensive, an expensive start. Okay, excellent. Oh, you look fancy, I like that. Um, you. 
Science console has been built. Holographic training center. Yeah, not too interesting actually. Let's go for the research because it's still quite weak. Nothing changed here, which is... Well, I'm not happy about that. I can be very honest about that. Let's take a quick look at ship designs. Um, are there things we want to be changing? Can we change them? Is it a smart thing to change them? Mm, well, nothing over here. We now have shields on here. That That is cool. I like that. Finally, shields on ships. Um, what's this? Weapon damage as well as... Well... Survivability or damage? That's a bit of a question, I guess. Okay, um, how about you? So, the Poseidon is now in here. You. There must be something that is... A smarter move. Combat disengagement chance. Or it just doesn't do it for me. Cargo hold. Ship upkeep. Negative 10. Uh, the upkeep is uh, 1.07. Can't say that is something I'm getting too enthusiastic about. Look, these guys definitely gone for hull points and, and the other one. Uh. This is all the top tier options. That's great. Do we save that? Can we change this one? No, we, we, we are we're definitely, definitely lacking components. Which is a mistake. I, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, I need to focus more and more on components. Hmm. But it's just... I'm sorry to say, it's not too interesting. This might be interesting, actually. So this is all uh, all hidden. No, it's survivability. Actually, wait. We needed to change something there, because we were actually having a down low. We don't like it when that happens, okay? So what changed? Probably this one. Hmm. Okay, so the Poseidon. Whoa, you are definitely a torpedo boat. I'm not sure if I'm happy to with that. We could go for the battle cruiser. They do look nice. Let's take a quick look. So that's a lot of beam weapons. Uh, against shield, against armor, armor, armor. We have a lot of other torpedo boats. Uh, the tracking is quite high, so it could be used against a smaller ship. The hull regen. Oh, I don't know. Um, let's do something different then. Let's go and if we want to do this, and I think we probably can't do to power. Hull regen, hull regen, uh, and you. Engineering team. Will this do anything for us? Let's take a quick look. Arm, armor is um, 560. So, 150 damage. That would be 4 shots. I think I'm okay with this one, actually. Auto upgrade. Yes, please. Did I do the automatic up upgrade with all of them? Because that is something that I would tend to forget. There you go. Everything could be upgraded. So, we have a bunch of things unlocked. Which is, of course, the dumbest thing you can do. Um, let's see. What would make... Starbase maintenance. Um, that would mean we only need two in Frontier. And then I would like to focus on Federation. Although... Hmm, 
Unlock access to the unique federation policy which enables you to set the focus on federal member world across the galaxy. Hmm. The Federal Federation Merchant Association is a service or organization charged with the duty of moving cargo and goods vital to the survival and expansion of the Federation. Um, perhaps? Member World Research Program. It is actually perhaps a better idea. To start working on the Federation plans first. I'm not sure what it will do. Implant and malfunctioning. We don't have them. Stop that. Remove implant. Where are you? Damn. That's a bloody long way. Uh, let's click you away. You're out there. You're over there. You're up there as well. Okay, we're aft. Go here. How long will it take you? 900. Oh, you will be just there. You're in the nick of time. You're there. Okay, let's unpause and let's continue. Hopefully, this won't be too bad. I did do a lot of work. So, we'll need to make sure that it isn't in vain. I'm waiting for the new council meeting. Uh, let's take a quick look on what we can do. Hmm. Indirect xenology. No purging. Preserving cultures. Uh, preserving culture. This is the largest one, so I would like to focus a tiny bit more of my effort to them. Embracing divinity. A diversity, sorry. A tradition. Adopted tradition in... Oh, okay, we can't do that. So this will go over time. These guys are happy. Uh, Federation policy trade. Federation policy. On trade. Consumer benefits? Is that what you want then? Focusing Federation trade policy will... Oh, we, we need to unfocus. We need to unfocus. I don't know if that's a good idea. Private healthcare will definitely piss off others. Private schools as well. Uh, defensive stance... Uh, restrict uh, our policies to defensive war only. Actually, that would be a good idea. We're the Federation. We don't go on all-out wars, right? Let's do it. <clears throat> oh, wow. Yeah, that will definitely do. lift a lot of embargoes. Damn. Okay, let's just um, let it go over time. Um... Reinforce the hull. A ship class has been retired. Wait, what? Really? This is a new one then. Oh, that's cool. Stop that. You look fantastic. I do like how you look. That's fantastic. Yeah, I do like how you look here. You a lot of power over there. So these are now the light cruisers. Huh. They're starting to look more and more like actual uh, Federation ships. Which we all know and love, of course, from the television. Um, I think we need to upgrade now. I don't think there's a, a lot of other options that we actually have. Uh, fleet management, did something change here? Uh, we can actually get rid of this one. 
Yeah, let's get rid of it. Just just so it looks a bit more clean. So we're on 141 or 51. Let's see. Oh, this is weird. <laughs> this is really weird. It's like your cruiser sign but done upside down. Okay, I like that. Uh, let's just continue with that. Sign ship is working like the on its best of abilities. Station damage, spatial torpedo refineries. Um, let's go for the torpedoes. Also, long term space habitation. Army upgrade fleet command limit major capital. Let's go for the major capital. I think it's definitely important. And how long is it going to take to integrate you guys? Because uh, it, it's been a long ass time now. Uh, city is being upgraded. Uh, we're on negative 8, which is not as good as I was hoping it would be. Especially because we did a lot of. Actually, I did a lot of changes. So we'll just have to wait. Wait and see. At least we're making a ton of energy. Hmm. Well, the trusses at a hundred, they're friendly, they're equivalent. Construction complete. I just wonder what the Kardashians are going to do. And the Endurance are being... Hey, did, wasn't this 75? No, it definitely wasn't. We need more stations as well. And that would really, really make us a lot stronger than the Endorians. That would make them love us. Because uh, they like power. They really do like power. Mm. If we go over this... Only the energy would go down, right? And I would like to have at least one or two stations in here. Oh, here we go, here we go. Plus 12 and plus 2. Huh, I managed to finally fix the economy. What a joy. What a joy. Can we not invite you guys anywhere? Uh, I did find a few that were willing to trade with me and other stuff. Mm. Yeah, you're gorgeous. Gorgeous beast. No. Oh, well, we'll just have to see what happens. So, the galaxy is unfolding. <clears throat> Here we go. Federation Council. Okay. Um, I don't want a neutral zone. Adjust fire science focus. Oh, okay, that's what we actually changed. Well, let's not. I would like to get these guys in. It's getting annoying that it's... Um, they're on 45%. Let's do a low one. And hopefully then somewhere in the next few years they finally decide that they, they feel federation. They, they feel like they're part of something larger than their own little spot in the dust that we call the galaxy. And the Endorians are just... How can I fix this, guys? Let me know. How can I fix the Endorians? And no, I'm not going into um, in the mod mode and change it. Not happening. Don't want that. It's not how we roll. We're just uh, goody goods. And we all know it. Still feeling that the science is still weak. The science is weak in this one. The fleet power is quite nice though. Look, even even these guys are higher in tech than they and than we are. That can never be a good thing, right? That is going to be a problem. Ships are upgraded. 1.6, that's really nice. Let's upgrade you once you're ready as well. Actually, I'm, I'm, I'm missing, I'm missing like Ford speed. Especially now. I was, I was hoping that we would be um, getting so many quests that I would actually lose my mind. 
Uh, but yeah, unfortunately, that's not happening. Hmm. Now, with all of this in the plus, I actually would not like, or actually wouldn't mind. How is that galactic thing going? Come on now. How is Earth dealing with it? Well, not too good. Trade. So, a commercial zone would probably benefit us. Hmm. Well, we'll have to see how things go. We need to wait until what population growth continue. Uh, more research, shield emitters. Um, like I said, I, I need more of these. Let's do it. New branch office, of course. By the um, by the Great Orion Free Sen I think we might have to go to war. Oh, we can't! No, we can't! We can't fall, we can't! <laughs> Damn it! Oh, uh, we can't because we're in defensive force only! <clears throat> Guys, what's going to be the end goal? Uh, I feel that we need it. Uh, we formed a federation. And even if you let the game run for a few thousand years, the federation is uh, most likely not going to be any larger than this. And... It's a shame, but it's just how things go. Acceptance. Yeah, I need to work on those, so we need to send out some money. Research agreement, negative 45. New branch officer. The Orions are spreading out like wildfire. That's, that's not good. <laughs> Damn it, that means that I need to start investing in cops. Uh, but I have to see what planet is the problem. Also, consumer goods has been uh, going down as well. Food, on the other hand, is finally starting to gain. Uh, it makes me happy, actually. The Armstrong City. A small settlement of the Armstrong City on the moon has been expanded greatly with new buildings and colonists. Colonists continue to flock to the new opportunities of Luna. Um, with one quote... With one quoted as saying, this is uh, is the monthly long lunar night. People say it's so barren and harsh, but it's not. It's beautiful. Excellent. So, Armstrong City to Earth, apparently. Um, what kind of decisions would we be able to do more? Um, at the Taiko City, apparently. Sure. I, I think it would benefit us. Let's also do... Now we have already nominated the plan, so we can't change it. I definitely would like to... Oh, look, boost the domination bit. Okay. Um, let us stop doing all of these because they cost us influence and we don't have that much of it um, oh that's not good yeah, you really are not liking me anymore are you border friction yeah you can say that again unfriendly attitude yeah that was your problem from the start you just don't like me I can help it. A minesweeper, star base photon pylon. It's interesting. I can tell you that. Let's get more defensive platforms. Uh, the implants have been removed. That's great news. Sign ship. Go back to automatic exploration. Then system has been surveyed. Yeah, that's great. Uh, but I'm starting to feel that I have no place or actually no clue on where to go next. I can't go to war because of my own deci uh, decisions. Um, we're waiting for the fleet to upgrade. Both of them. Um, we shall win the day. We're equivalent to the Cardassians, but we can't go to war with them. I don't know. 
what would be a good um, a good drop off point? Because I would actually start like uh, I would like to play as the Bream, you know, and um, just see what we can do. The Klingon Empire has closed borders, which is nothing new. Hmm. Not much we can change, huh? Oh, there's actually one thing we can change. Um, it's this one. Where's the one? Here he is. Let's get the naval logistic in there. Um, 63%. percent we're making plus three right now, so let's do a large negotiation. Hopefully next time we can actually uh, integrate these uh, these guys. And we need to focus on consumer goods. But that's out. Anyways, that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.